Happy New Year from Pass Down Garage. This is our first video of 2023. Today we are going to clean out the garage so we can work on the Mustang. Finally, Dad got a roll cage for Christmas, but before we work on the car, we gotta clean out this garage. video of 2023 for Pass It Down Garage. I'm Brian, this is Gage, and we have a lot of stuff we're going to be discussing on the vehicle. Uh, we have a 1967 Mustang that we have been doing a full restoration on, and as of right now, uh, we're getting to the point where we have a new roll cage that just came in um, uh, for Christmas, and uh, we have a big old list that we put on the car that we're going to start uh, doing a series we start checking down the list and getting stuff done on this car. We're trying to have it done for spring and or early summer this year. Um, what have you been up to, Gage? Um, probably like cleaning out the garage so we could walk around the Yeah, we've already cleaned the garage out a little bit so we can walk around it. And uh, now we uh, we uh, got some goodies that came in the mail today. Uh, go ahead, won't you go ahead and grab those? Yeah. Um, you want me to grab? Just grab the other things first. These ones? Yep. Oh, okay. You grab the first one. Okay. I got one. Alright. So we've got some more uh, little GoPro style uh, 4K cameras um, that we're going to be using at our events this year. Uh, <laughs> good job. Yeah, I uh, saw the screen on Lego. Yeah, that was pretty good. Okay. But anyways, we're, we've got more cameras. Uh, we have a total of three of this style camera, which is the 4K. We have another 4K with a suction cup, and then um, a standard high definition one that is an older one. Um, along with my Canon camera and my uh, Galaxy S22 Ultra and my old Galaxy phone, we should have a lot of cameras and stuff, uh, angles at the events that we go to. And my iPod. And your iPod. Um, we, you know, whenever we have extra people come, they're going to be videotaping as well. So we have um, you know, people on the end of the track, mid-track, and at the starting line and all that type of stuff. So it should be a fun year. Uh, we do have a lot of events that we're going to be trying to go to. Um, of course, we want to have the car together so we can take it to the events and enjoy and have video content of us um, enjoying the car. Um, but of course, uh, if the car's not done, we're still going to be doing some videos. Um, as of right now, we're looking at doing a Hoosier No Prep series uh, here in Indiana. Um, NISO, which is Northern Indiana Shootout. Um, it's usually at Mentone Airport um, up north. It's yeah. about a two, two and a half hour drive from where we live. So. Wow, we have been there before. We've been up there before. It was actually really nice. I mean, it's, it's just kind of laid back. Is it the one that we would truck him? No, that was uh, War of the Woods, which we're going to do that one again this year too. We'll spend the night. Um, which one? Are we, which, which this is the one where we saw um, Adam Hudson oh. and Nick Taylor uh, when they had Mountain Dew and Gap Train. No, he doesn't have Mountain Dew. No, nah, he sold Mountain Dew, but he's still got Uncle Sam. He's working on it. Yeah. And hopefully, he'll have it done soon. Yeah, on, um, um, and what was it called again? I can't forget it. What are you talking about? The, where we crashed. Oh, he crashed at War in the Woods. Yeah, he crashed it right into one spin out. Yeah, it was a bad wreck, and we're glad to see that he's getting it back together. So if you... He got a front end and stuff. 
yeah, you got the front end put all back together. If you want to check it out, go to Nikki Bobby Inc. And you can see the build on where he's at so far on it. So, uh, but we're in the process of doing, um, the, we're going to be doing the cage here soon on our car. We got to get all the interior out, start cleaning the stuff out and everything. Um, yeah, we did get a new goodie that came in today. Why don't you grab those? So we've got this in the mail, came in from Amazon earlier today. So these are my new LED headlamps that, um, that are blue halo. That we'll be installing on the Mustang either today and or tomorrow. Um, Is it in the front? Oh. Yeah, that's, that's going to replace those headlights right there, but it's got a blue halo that goes around it, and then these are all LED lights, so it'll be bright and that will be able to see really well with it. So uh, we may actually install that here in a second, so we'll, we'll see. Do you want to go ahead and put these in? Yeah. All right, let's go ahead and do it. All right, Gage, you ready? Yep. All right. So first thing we need to do is get this Phillips screwdriver. We can take out these three Phillips screws. Got it. Right here. Okay. Be very careful when you bring it out. Mm -hmm. Go until it like does this until it clicks, and then hold on to it and pull it out so you don't scratch the paint. Okay. Mm -hmm. and we'll put it down here. So get this next one here. Which way? Uh, righty, righty, tighty, lefty, loosey. So it's going left. It's loosey. Be careful that you don't click on it. It's over this way, probably somewhere. All right. I heard it go down. Well, yeah, we'll find it later then. Um, it's right there. Yep. Yep. Found it. Yeah. Good. All right. So then we're going to be taking and loosening these three screws that are here. Now these you don't pull out all the way. You're just going to loosen them enough to get the ring to move out of the way because you'll have to twist it. Okay. Twist the light bulb. You'll twist this ring, and the ring will release. Okay, so that should be enough. So now you're gonna take this ring, mm -hmm. and you're gonna twist it, and it'll click. Click. Now the whole assembly will come out. We'll go and unplug it. Okay. So now if you wanna grab our new one, So we have a wire that's gonna go right here. These two wires, one's for a turn signal, which we're not gonna use, because we're gonna have our turn signals down here. And the second one is for our halo, okay? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna be wiring this here in a little bit, but first, just for you know, our basic installation, we're gonna go ahead and take it and put it together here. Let's see where the lines are. Cool, we got these little tab lines here. Mm -hmm. You see these little tabs? Yeah, those line up with the Exactly, tabs. exactly. So, let's go ahead and get this plugged in. Get that plugged. Okay. Push it in tight. It's all we together. Yep. Good. We'll go ahead and take this, snake this through. Yeah, 
so hang on. Gotta get this lined up. There's only one way to really get this thing to line up correctly. So we gotta find out which way it goes. Um, can you give me a five head screwdriver, please? Is this the same? Is it the same one as this? No, that is a Phillips. We need a flathead. Oh, I know. Flathead. need something just to push it in a little bit. Yep, that'll work. Thank you. So we got the headlights installed and they're looking really good. I really am liking the uh, the look of it, how it's dark uh, with my black on the blue pattern. It's gonna look really good. And those halos are gonna look killer whenever they're lit up. Um, the next thing we're gonna be doing here is we're gonna shortly uh, be going through this list that I have on the car. Um, basically, this is all the stuff that I need to get done, hopefully by uh, spring, to be able to get the vehicle complete the way I want it. There are some things that we will not be doing on the car um, just because it's not a necessity. Um, we have some stuff that we'll be uh, adding at a later date. Uh, right now we just want to get the main stuff um, done, um, like wipers and things like that. And I won't really need that stuff until later. Nitrous, I don't really have to have the nitrous on until the car's running and it's tuned. So we'll be uh, working to get all that stuff done um, at a later date. Um, I do have one of my aluminum valve covers, fabricated valve covers that um, I got uh, kind of just sitting there just to see what it looks like. I still have the other side that I have to to uh, replace and change. And so 
uh, we'll be doing some more to the car um, on the next episode. And so, guys, stay tuned, and we'll see you guys later.